All right, next up we have, what do we have? We have Laurence. <laughs> Poor Laurence is going to be kicking herself the rest of her life because those judges palpably wanted her to win. And I think that you could really tell that they were very disappointed in her collection. Starting off though, I think that her starting piece was really, really strong, really, really beautiful, actually. Be a little bit too similar to her just bad jumpsuit, but eh, what are you gonna do? A win's a win. Her second piece, honestly, she should have just ditched. She could have made like another piece or something. I don't know. I just, I really feel like Laurence did not course correct well. She should have taken this piece out. Her third look is terrible. It's like her collection is so far off of what she should have been doing. She should have focused on what the judges applauded her for. You have to pay attention to Project Runway to what gets you to that point. And then maybe you can like add a little bit more flavor. But you have to stay true to what the judges liked about your work. And they liked the severity. They liked the Parisianness of it. And I just don't see any Parisian here. It literally looks like something that you pick up at pink. Like Victoria's Secret pink and that's not good. Again, her next look, Ann Taylor Loft, blah. Like, it's just, next look is also Ann Taylor Loft. She just made these like total nondescript tops to put under her pieces. I don't know what she did with the time that she was allotted for her collection, but like she did not use it wisely. Another Ann Taylor Loft piece. There's no Laurent signature. I don't know who Laurent is as a designer based on this collection, sorry. Like I really liked Laurent and I wanted her to win, I think more than any other designer, but I can't look at this collection and say, yes, you should have won, you were robbed. But she wasn't, she totally blew it. She Bosovic, she Edmonded, she blew what was basically given to her. I, I do like the fact that this piece doesn't have a back, but that's about all I can say. That's like the only notable thing about it. I'm pretty sure you can get those collapse at Gap. This is just a travesty of an outfit. It's the proportion is so wrong. I don't understand the construction. It looks slapped together. I didn't watch the first part of the episode, so maybe she slapped this together at the last moment, but there's just no construction. There's no fit. It just didn't work. I don't, I just don't know. I just don't know. And then there's just nothing that I can say. There's really just, there's nothing that I can even break down. I look at the entire collection, it's a beautiful color palette, and it's a beautiful texture scheme. It basically, it looks like a great design board. It just never came together at all to form clothes. All these great ideas were there, and maybe she just needed more time to flesh them out, and I, I don't doubt that, but this is Project Runway. You have the time that you have. You know the time that you have. And Laurent's never suffered from time restraints before, so I just don't understand what happened here. I actually really like her finale look. I think it's very Parisian, rugged, chic. I love how raw it is, and I wish that we had just seen maybe some more of this from her collection. It would have maybe come out in a different way for Laurent's. I think that the sort of onesie flap thing doesn't really look that great. But um, I think that the mixture of materials and construction is gorgeous. But again, like we needed to see 10 looks that looks like this, not just one.